yeah. So this is Pedro. So I've been watching some guys. the majority <laughs> or some of my vlogs anyway. So yeah. thanks for tuning in. So we're no back problem. here at um, back here at Iris Garage. We're at Garden State Golf. And we're in Maplewood. Maplewood, yeah. Maplewood, in, New Jersey. New Jersey. In South Orange. And uh, I've been given a key somewhere to the workshop yeah. where the challenger is. How are you? I'm good. <laughs> so uh, Ira has just uh, given me this gift. Does anybody recognize this plate? This is the Vanishing Point Challenger number plate from the movie. Let's get some white paint now. <laughs> yeah. The Challenger. So here we are back at the Challenger and all the parts that I've ordered except for the carburetor rebuild kit have arrived. That's them sitting there. I went shopping this morning to AutoZone and bought a whole load of tools. Uh, Ira has very kindly got the uh, windscreen fitted while I'm away. So new windscreen's in there and it looks very, very good. And what an awesome machine this is. I cannot wait to get it going. Uh, it's going to need a lot of work before I get it to that point. Tires are flat, they're perished. I've got my tires right enough. And the brakes are all needing done. I've got <laughs> a lot of tools that I bought in AutoZone this morning. So hopefully this is going to be enough to get the Challenger running. I'm still going through all the, the parts I've ordered from Classic Industries, trying to make sure that everything is here. Uh, first thing I've got to do is take the wheels off and there's a garage just up the road uh, who is going to fit the tires for me. I have to say, Ira, the guy I bought the car from, who's stored it for me for the last month, has been an absolute legend. He has helped me out so much. I definitely could not get this car running without his help. Even down to little things, like he set this little table up for me to put all my stuff on. How kind is that? So anyway, um, thank you so much Ira and I'm going to get started on the Challenger because there is a very long drive ahead of me. Mexico awaits. So that's the wheels off the Challenger, there are we at a wee tyre garage just up the road, uh, getting the new tyres put on. I'm about to start on the brakes, but meantime I thought I'd just show you, what we have here is all of the parts that I've bought to get the Challenger running, which all looks really great, you know, look at all these nice new shiny parts, really exciting, but trying to order those parts back home was an absolute nightmare, especially trying to get them shipped from three different suppliers all to Iris Garage. Especially when there was a lot of questions, a lot of things I didn't know the answer to, like what size drums were the front and rear? Apparently there was like three different options and there was no way to find out without going out and actually measuring them. Uh, so I've unfortunately had to order the duplicate. So I've got a few extra parts here that I might not need. But what I've got here is brake cylinders, four wheel drums on this. So I've got brake cylinders here. Um, I've got the hardware kit for the brake cylinders. It's all these springs and clips and stuff. New wiper blade, again I guess the size, new oil filter, yes I'm going to change the oil, unheard of I know. This is a new fuel tank sender seal and a new fuel tank sender. I've got a fan shroud for it here so that I don't catch my fingers on the metal finger chopping fan blade that it has. I have a rubber seal thing, I don't know where that goes. This goes for the gear stick to stop the fumes entering the car. Um, flexi hoses, there's only three in the car. I've got six here. Again, I didn't know which ones it was. An antenna, because I'm feeling very optimistic and getting a radio. The tools I bought, Imperial spanners. This is a wire brush. Cable ties, Allen keys, adjustable spanner. Uh, meter, grease, WD-40, brake cleaner, brake fluid, water, tea for me and a knife and I've got wee sockets out there with a cheap one. Um, oh and this obviously you saw that earlier I cannot believe Ira got this for me it's absolutely amazing what a really cool and kind gesture. 
So that is going on the front of the Challenger. I might paint it white, but I don't know. Um, there's loads to be done, loads to be done. So I best get started. I am absolutely shattered. Um, it's been quite a long day, to be honest. The jet lag's really starting to catch me up. Haven't got as much done tonight or today as I hoped to get through, but at least now everything's set up. I've got my tools purchased, I've got all the parts for the car, uh, I've got the car up in axle stands, tires have been changed, so that's all done. Uh, so I have actually done quite a lot, it's just that it doesn't feel like I've done that much. Anyway, so I'm gonna go. Um, good night, Challenger. See you tomorrow. Hello. 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 Can I order a uh, pizza for delivery? And can the delivery address please? Um, I don't actually know the address. The wrench. Wrench. I sound like an American, right? Uh, adjustable. What do you call it? Adjustable spanner. Um, can you find me house number? Uh, okay. Let me go and have a look outside. See if it's on the, the door. Can I get um a thin crust pizza with uh, yeah with um, ham, cheese and mushrooms on it. Yeah, 